uh, this simulation will involve uh, a population of uh, uh, foxes and rabbits and it's called um, uh, predator prey uh, simulation uh, which uh, uh, is used uh, in uh, uh, many mathematical models that uh, um, uh, try to uh, study the uh, uh, population dynamics uh, where um, if uh, uh, at, um, um, uh, area is uh, small and enclosed it can lead to uh, overcrowding uh, and uh, predators can then uh, easily find prey. Uh, or uh, there can be uh, the problem of environmental pollution uh, that um, uh, will not guarantee a good enough, uh, uh, a big enough uh, uh, prey population uh, in order for even a small uh, predator population to survive. Uh, an example of this is uh, the Lotka Volterra um, uh, model uh, that was used uh, for um, uh, the uh, fish population in the Adriatic Sea during the World War, uh, after the effects of the World War uh, One, and uh, this. Um, in these situations, uh, a, a prey uh, can also be uh, a predator. I mean, um, in these cases, a predator uh, can be also a prey uh, for other species. Uh, in um, uh, the first version of the simulation, there will be uh, uh, perfectly uh, well-functioning um, simulation uh, from the user's point of view uh, but uh, it will have um, 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 so, some uh, things that are not so good uh, when uh, uh, considering uh, the object-oriented um, uh, design and implementation uh, so uh, the objective is to um, the goal is to uh, create to uh, develop uh, several uh, improved versions that uh, pro progressively uh, solve this problem um, and introduce new abstraction techniques uh, so uh, in the first part, in the first part, uh, the, before even uh, adding some improvements, uh, the underlying mechanism of the simulation uh, should be analyzed.